Hello guys, welcome back to another new video. I'm sure you listened this music and saw this music video. That is Sia Chip Reels. But do you know how to make this old type video? In this video, I'm going to show you how to make this old type CRT video effect on film material. So without any delay, let's get started. So you can see I already added a video into the timeline. So first we need to create this black shape. For this select video then go stock media. Then go library and then go solid color. And add a black color into the upper track. So now select this black color and go mask. Now you need to draw a mask for old TV shape. But we take a snapshot from Sia Chiptil's video as a reference. So simply add this snapshot, then add this into the upper track. Then lock this layer, then select black color and go draw mask and add a mask like this. You need to take time for smooth mask. So after done, unlock this snapshot, then delete this. Then select the black mask and invert this mask and also increase some blur strength and now you can see it's look like a old tv shape but if you don't want to add mask you can use this shape shape link given on the description below so for use this shape first you need to delete the black color so simply delete the black color then add this shape into the upper track Then select the shape and go basic. Then go blending mode and set blending mode to multiply. So now you can see it's look like more exciting. Okay now we need to change our video color that is black and white. So for this go adjustment layer and add adjustment layer into the upper track. Then go effects and search ink oil and add this ink oil effect into the adjustment layer. Then go to the color section. Then go to the light section. And you can increase some exposure, brightness and contrast for more retro look. Okay, now it's perfect. Now we need to add some blur. For this, go Boris FX, then go blur and add a Gaussian blur into the adjustment layer. Then go to the effects section and set Gaussian blur level to 2%. And now you can see it's look like perfect for old TV color. Okay, now we need to add lyrics. So for lyrics, I add a music here. Now you can see I already added a music into the timeline. Now it's time to add lyrics. So first select adjustment layer and this black shape and drag to the upper track because we need to add lyrics below the black shape. Then go titles and add the default title into the empty track. Then go where you want to add your lyrics. So I want here. Now lock the all layer without text. So now select your text and edit your text from here. Change the font. Then change font size and decrease some scale. Then reposition the text like this. So now you can add a text animation. For this, go to the first frame of text, then add a keyframe on position. Then down it takes like this. Then go some frame later and set text to the upside like this. Now let's take preview. Baby, I'm calling for you. Okay, it's better. Now set the out animation. 
for this for some frame later and add a keyframe on position then again go some frame later and set text the downside okay then add your next lyrics just simply split the text and you can see our text is duplicate with animation now just edit your text here okay it looks great now set the lyrics length okay it's perfect let's take a preview okay it's great now the final part now we can add some noise lens distortion and add some scan light effect so for this unlock all layer then again select the adjustment layer and black shape and drag into the upper track then add a new adjustment layer into the empty track then go to the effect section then go new blue effects and go essential then add lens correction into the adjustment layer then select this and go effect section and set distortion to 7 you can see this distortion also works in text ok now again go effect section and search noise and add this retro noise overlay into the new adjustment layer then select this and set opacity to 20% then the final effects is scan line. For this, go Boris effects, then go stylize. Then add this BCC scan line effect into the new adjustment layer. Then set your size, thickness, and softness according to your video. Then increase the mix with original. Now it's look like the real retro TV effect. So now render it and check our final preview. So you can see our Sia Chip Thrills video effects is now ready. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any question, please let us know in the comment section. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.